What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, just finished doing the SmackDown live stream reaction with the homie Dub. Shout out to everyone that was a part of the stream. I really do appreciate y'all for, uh, you know, joining in. It's always a good time when you guys join into the stream. We have, you know, it makes the streams that much better when we're watching the shows. Uh, but I, I really wanted to talk about Edge pretty much maybe maybe we're not 100 percent certain but there have been uh reports that the uh the match he had tonight with sheamus was his last contractual match and the rumors have been going that this was going to be his last match it was in toronto in front of his family and friends crowd was crazy they were doing promo packages and video packages from various superstars talking about their experience with edge and all he's done in the business you would think that this would be his retirement match you would think that this would be his last match in wwe and it seemed that way just the way they set up everything the way everything was laid out for the show the show was really revolving around edge and i appreciated that um earlier in the show you know it kind of revolved around la Knight and what he had going on but the overall theme of the show was mostly about edge and his career and what he's done and i must say the match he had with sheamus was fantastic i enjoyed it the crowd enjoyed it only thing that took away from the match was the commercials and i i really do wish we would have got a match on a pay-per-view preferably preferably like a wrestlemania or something like that a big pay-per-view where we could have enjoyed the match in its full entirety without commercial breaks that's what kind of messed up the match for me but outside of that it was fantastic hard hitting i don't think we've ever seen sheamus and edge have a match together and edge last week on smackdown coming out saying that really it was sheamus that was able to get him back in the ring to give him that confidence to get back in the ring and i never knew that so that was a, a very interesting story and if edge had decided to sheamus for him to be you know his last opponent potentially i think that's awesome i, th I think that's awesome for for sheamus to have that 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 moment so i don't know like i said most of the time with re retirement matches the opponent well the the person that's retiring usually ends up or ends up putting over the person you know you know in the match he's feuding with or having a match with so i don't know per se if this is his last match but it definitely seemed that way the the, the pageantry and everything they gave him the pyro for his entrance the crowd singing his entrance was amazing when he won the match you know seeing beth phoenix out there you know kind of getting emotional tearing up seeing his kids out there and then the pyro he got for that afterwards was amazing too so you would think maybe this is uh where he hangs it up i don't know i hope he at least they never really stated that and i can appreciate that because it kind of leaves the door open once again the rumors are this is his last contractual engagement from wwe but there could be something he do in the future they may extend it for him to maybe have one more match and like i said if it was if there was any time for him to retire i would love for it to been at wrestlemania or a a pay-per-view a bigger pay-per-view um with no commercial breaks and uh you know a bigger venue you know i think the edge deserves that but if he wanted it to be in toronto and wanted it to end it that way who am i to say you know to argue with that um if it is his if that was his last match man i will say this um thank you once again edge i doubt you see this but maybe someone shows this to you but thank you once again edge for the many many entertaining years that you have provided us um you just just by putting your body on the line uh being out there you know being the dastardly heel he was so good at being like the dude made you want to hate him but you, you had to appreciate that type of talent um being the the outstanding individual to be willing to put your body on the line for over 25 years just to entertain us is something to be admired and something to be appreciated for uh him stepping away even though he didn't want to those many years ago and then being able to finally have that courage to come back and do it again like he never left is 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 a beautiful sight to see 
So once again, thank you, Edge, for just providing us with many years of entertainment. And, uh, you know, if that was your last match, hey, man. We 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 enjoyed the match that you you and Seamus put on tonight. It was a really great one, and uh, we're just very appreciative for the career that we were able to watch, when, <laughs> all the way from when you were young, all the way to where you are now. You are a certified legend, an undeniable goat in WWE. No one can ever take that away from you. And coming from me, we appreciate you. We love you, Edge. Thank you so much all you've done you know for the business you know so hey comment down below let me know what's your favorite edge match edge moment let me know do you guys think that was his last match do you guys think that's how he's gonna end it and that's how his career is gonna uh you know the his career closes in wwe with the match we just saw saw with him and sheamus do you guys think he's gonna go to AEW? uh for a little bit to join up with christian or whatnot let me know down below i want to know your favorite match your favorite moment where do you think his future lies will he go to aew let me know down below man and also you think you know me but i appreciate all the love and support road to 150k and i'm still young speedy youtube wrestling champion of the world appreciate y'all kicking with me see y'all next one peace